is practice and I'm back on site again today, except today I'm here in the afternoon. You'll notice the sun is coming from that direction. I had been coming in the morning most days, but it seems like it was going to work out better for River if I started transitioning to being with him in the morning to help him with his homeschool activities and then coming here in the afternoon. And that's totally fine as long as I don't have to coordinate with any contractors who might be showing up. So I think this is going to be my, my new pattern and I think it's important to kind of reevaluate your patterns from time to time to see if they still make sense. I started coming in the morning just because I was doing full days and a lot of contractors were showing up and I wanted to be here, but now that it's just myself, doesn't really matter when I come, so whatever works better for River is what I'm going to be doing. Uh, as you can see behind you on the floor here, uh, I've got some boards laid out. Uh, what I'm working on, uh, if you look back in front of you over here by me, is uh, I had to move around a little bit of the wall here. I finally got the plans for the shower and the tub unit upstairs. And I was looking at them and uh, some of the stud wall had to be kind of uh, reconfigured so that uh, there were places to attach the, the piping. And also the valve is going to be right here and you can't have a stud right in the middle of where the valve is going to be. So I, I uh, just knocked some of these guys out. I used a, a sledgehammer just to kind of tap them out on the bottom, then pull them out on the top. Uh, flattened the nails out and then just did toenails in to get them in the new positions. So this is all set and I've been working on this back wall which uh, has a 16, a 16 inch gap between the first studs, then two 14 inch gaps and then another 16 and that fits in. I've got preset right over here if you want to take a look on this side. Uh, I've got the, uh, the header board and the two footers. Uh, they, I need two of them because they have to go around that pipe in the back over there and then here are all of the vertical studs. They're all perfectly eight foot studs which is pretty darn convenient. As you can see, windows are all open. Uh, we have a nice warm day yesterday and today and it's dry so I'm taking the opportunity to open up the windows, let some warmth in. The warmth will help warm up the slab. It's dry air coming in and also I did some sweeping. I swept out a ton of sawdust uh, just get outside and I'm uh, letting the wind kind of blow or, you know, a bunch of the rest outside. So it's kind of a little bit of spring cleaning without me having to really do much of it because the wind is doing it for me. So anyway, I'm going to put this wall together, get it up on the back there. That'll give me a little bit more time. Maybe I can work on the wall on that side. But within a week, I think within the next week, I should have all the walls done. And then we can get the plumbers in here, hopefully right before coronavirus starts mucking things up for contractors with you know, their kids or their families or whatever. Hopefully we can get this all done because if we can get the plumbing done, we can do all the electrical work on our own. That's it. Thanks for watching.